Welcome to Dosta! Today we are going to ask people their best and worst thing of 2021 in VR. Let's have a look, shall we? Basically, the best thing that happened to us this year was that we actually get into the world of uh, VKIT because before, I, I think it was September or either, even before, we did know nothing about VKIT and also yeah, we're very curious about some events. Then Shadow told us about the VKIT and then we got some information, collected it, knew, and met some people like you guys and other, some other different people. It was the best experience I have ever had in VRChat. But what do you say, Kola, about this? Yeah, I would agree to what you said. It's like for me or for us also the best thing was like when we met Shadow because he helped us a lot in Yarcha this year to get around or like teach us stuff about like the I would say Japanese or like also the Vika or the Japanese community. Sounds like and... Shadow paid you guys to give me a compliment. <laughs> no, 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 wait, 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 no, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> So the worst memory for us was like we have a small VR chat group and a Discord group also. And this year was like a roller coaster. It was terrible for like our group because many people like fight it. Our group like split it in like three different groups. And in this groups again, there were like people fighting. Really terrible for us because we, me and Chaos, we both tried to like get the group back together. And we still, it ha like it happens six or seven months ago. So we still try to get the group together. And it's really hard because there are like people who say that they don't like the other person from our group. And that's the big problem leads us to like, we have no, really no a solution for it. Do you agree, Kirk? Yeah, actually I do. Because the, the thing is, almost everything I have have tried to do to get our group together didn't work up because yeah either the one said i don't want to to meet the other one they just said no i don't have time on purpose although they had time and played with other other guys this made me kind of sad because i we you have to know in the past year end of the year we almost played every day it was like a real friendship between us but then suddenly some things happened some complications happened and then the group split up this was really Heartbreaking. Like, I, I almost lost all of my really, really close friends in VRChat. Well, the funniest thing that happened to me in VRChat was when I was standing in front of a mirror and then two friends came up to me with, uh, what's it called? You know, this anime girl? And yeah, they came up to me and they changed to that avatar and they started slapping their boobs against each other next to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, the best memory, it's really hard for me because I'll have to make a list out of it. So long story short, ever since I started going out with Alina, uh, every single moment I've spent with her, they're the best memories of mine on VR chat. The worst memory I have is when I was in a karaoke world and some freaking guys kept queuing some memes instead of karaoke. They kept skipping all the things I, I tried to put in the karaoke screen and they would put a meme instead. They just wouldn't go away. They, that was really annoying. They were going from instance to instance on the same world. They, just, they were just hopping through every instance of karaoke and ruining it. It was really annoying. That's the worst memory I have of your chat. My worst memory of, uh, to, to 2021, it all happened in the beginning of 2021, that was January itself. I had a really good friend circle and the guy who introduced me to all those the people I'm friends with at the moment, he became a little unstable because none of the things were working out and in the end he purged his friends list and unfriended everyone and he just simply went off VR chat and I never got to see him again. Uh, it kind of makes me feel sad whenever I think about it. So that's the worst memory of mine on VR chat. Um, the best things to happen to me in 2021 is definitely uh, being part of the beer co music community, being part of the like DJing events and all the people surrounding it, and really being supported by all the people, and actually making myself go into music. 
that's definitely the best thing that happened to me in 2021. I guess the hate and the stigma around being a bit more of a loot person in VR chat, even though it's not like a bad thing. People assuming you're bad for being loot, which is not really the case. You're just, your interests are just different from others. The best thing that happened for me this year, basically VTV World. I had so much fun doing that. Uh, not just the event that we did in December, but also the event at Animazement. So much fun, so many new people to meet, so many interesting things to experience. Well, the worst thing basically happened at the end of this year is that I realized I don't have enough time to spend in VR as much as I want to. I wish I could spend more time in VR. The best thing was being an MC at an event at VRCon. Uh, that was my first time up on stage like that, and it was an incredible experience that I'd really hope to repeat. Uh, my friend also came back from military service, and that was really exciting for me. Um, we had a party for him in VR. In my case, the worst part of VR chat was having to put it on hold this year. Most of my friends, or pretty much all of my friends, are here. My social activities, especially during the pandemic, were here. And all my creative activities were here as well. I've managed to move some of my creative urge to reading, uh, in thinking, in philosophy, in meat space. But uh, there's no space there to speak or practice Japanese. And I get that itch pretty bad sometimes, so that's rough. We ask everyone to give their best and worst moments of 2021, and a lot of people responded. We thank you very much for that. Speaking of 2021, 2022 is coming up. We have some New Year's resolutions for 2022. We are going to do our best to make more videos to entertain you people more. With that said, 2022 is just around the corner. Happy New Year, and see you until next year. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, please give us a comment and subscribe our channel. See you in next video!